Hello everybody, my name is Ed and welcome to He Beat Her. I don't know if today 9pm is part of the title, but welcome to He Beat Her today at 9pm. A game I found on Itch.io that apparently discusses a domestic violence case in the courtrooms and we are going to play a lawyer. I could have this game <laughs> totally wrong, but that seems to be what the blurb suggested. So if you guys are looking forward to that and having some heavy hitting subject matter on Gamehog, be sure to like the video, subscribe to Gamehog if you already haven't, and leave us a comment comment down there with positive vibes because this might be a bit depressing. Courtroom, 3 p.m. Okay, so this is where we're starting. Sorry, in the courtroom. The court appointed you for another domestic abuse case. We are the lawyer. I was right. It's hopeless. Your client accused of abuse is going to be found guilty. Okay, so domestic violence is obviously a very difficult subject to be handling here because a lot of people go through it. So if you are experiencing domestic abuse, please do know that there are people who can help and there are people who are willing to listen and willing to put you in a better scenario. There's always a way out. It's the five minute afternoon break. Your client sits next to you. His ex sits across the aisle. I like this. Look at all the melting artwork. Is that meant to be the evil man? Because that's great imagery. Right after this break is the verdict. You're running out of time to defend him. There's only time for one more action. What should I do? Evidence. You list what you know. Your client is being accused of emotional and physical abuse. Correct. Last Friday at 9pm, a bloody knife was found in the couple's kitchen. The prosecutor had not disclosed their medical information. Out of all the facts in the case, these stand out to you. That was weird. I just typed in evidence as a guess and it actually worked. Came up with something. The breaks up. Your client is found guilty and given a jail sentence of a year. As he's led out of the courtroom, you wonder... What if there was more to this case than meets the eye? Wait a minute, so this is gonna be like Groundhog Day? We're gonna have to keep going back over and over again until we get this right? It's time for one more action. What should I do? Question. I need to say the right thing. Uh, wh uh, what should I discuss? Um, uh, abuse. Were you abused or did you abuse? That seems like the right kind of question. That's quite blunt. It's okay if you don't want to answer. I wasn't abused. That's shameful. Don't ask me that again, please. Hmm. The breaks up. Your client didn't set a chance. His ex managed to get a restraining order against him. As he's let out the courtroom, you wonder... Was the ruling just? Okay, I I wasn't sure what to expect from this. This is really cool. I like this. I've got to try and think what areas have I not plundered. There's only time for one more action. Okay, so what do I do? What should I do? I'm a lawyer. My client has been beating his wife mercilessly for some time. Medicals? I don't think so. What should I do? Think, talk, observe, grab, and many other different actions. Okay, so, uh, let's try talk. I need to say the right thing. Knife! Discuss knife! It's hot as hell. What's- what's going on? Why are you wearing that turtleneck? Because I'm cold. I need the truth if you want to stand a chance. Look, I have some scars on my arms, it's no big deal. I fell from the stairs is all. What's the scar on your neck? This? Haha, <laughs> fine, you want the truth? She came at me one day with a knife! I did it! Oh my god! And I had to block her as she headbutted me. Dude, get out of this! But who's gonna believe that? The worst part of it, I still love her. This new story is valuable, but it's only spoken words. It might not hold up in court. The breaks up. The plaintiff has flimsy evidence. The judge seems to deem your client innocent. You feel like justice has not been served, however, as he's let out of the courtroom, you wonder... Was justice served? So hang on, hang on, hang on, whoa, 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 stop. So wait, we got the guy clear. We managed to get him clear because we managed to get him to admit that there were marks on his neck. What else do I... Okay, let's see what else we can do. So apparently there's 235 possible choices in this game that lead to 42 different paths, kind of, or endings coming to a close at the end. I think that's just mental. So what should I do? Question. Let's try, uh, uh... Uh, what should I do? I don't know what to say. What should I do? Um, uh, uh, I don't, I actually have no idea at this point. Okay, so you could do things like observe. So let's try, uh, observe. What should I observe? Client. He wears heavy eye bags and a tunnel next one. I'm sorry, I've read that like such a div kid. I'm sorry. He may have once been an energetic man, but you can't tell now. A tunnel neck in a hot courtroom? 
the brakes up. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know. We know. Okay, let's try thinking. I'm gonna think. You forgot something important. Client? Think about the client. The client acts strange. Past abusers you've interacted with were manipulative, sometimes even charming. Your client makes little eye contact, seems to hide underneath his sweater. The brakes up. Look, I already know this! We know he's got this shit under him! How do I convince him to tell Ty- Wait, is convince a thing? Convince. I need to say the right thing. Uh, turtleneck. It's hot as hell. Why are you wearing that turtleneck? I know! We know this! We know! This isn't going well at all. Hang on, let's see what else we can find. Let's try talk. I need to say the right thing. Uh, no, okay, I don't- I don't want to do that. Wait, there was a grab option. Let's try grabbing. Grab. I need to hurry. What to grab? What is there to grab? Her- Ass. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Fine. Phone? Hey, nice phone- Whoa! Who is this? Hey, nice phone you got there. Mind if I take a look? Plaintiff. Um, what kind of a question is that? No, sorry. Asking her isn't going to work, but if you really wanted to, you could distract her with something. Uh, d what do I distract her with? Uh, um, uh, dance. Mission f <laughs> What was I thinking? What was the best I thought was gonna happen? What was her name? Who even was that? Maybe there's more I could have done? Fuck, this is hard. Let's try remember. Try and remember something. Uh, abuse? Do you know abuse? Maybe you haven't repressed memories of abuse. Oh god, I'm really, really struggling to read these, I'm sorry. Freud would say, so you remember a girl named Gianna? Gianna? Who the fuck is Gianna? Hang on, hang on, Let, let's talk about Gianna. Gianna! You think Gianna has beautiful red- Who the fuck is Gianna? You can't remember anything else, you still have her number, but there's no reason to call it. Is there? I, d I just don't know, dude. The break's up. Can't lose the case, she's let out of the courtroom. Fuck me! Let's ask her some things. Let's ask. Ask? Need to say the right thing. Uh... Uh, uh, I, I don't know anymore! I don't know what to ask these people! If it's all down to one question, this is fucking mental! What's Gianna? Tell me what Gianna is. Do I know Gianna? A what now? A girl named Gianna. Hmm, come to think of it, I think my girlfriend, her ex, used to talk about a Gianna. They could share everything together, stuff she wouldn't even share with me. Everything. Hmm, I wonder if I could get in contact with Gianna. Okay, so we need to speak to Gianna. Grab phone. Yep, uh, phone, and then, nice phone you got there. Mind if I take a look? Uh, what kind of a question is that? No, sorry, yeah, well, I need to get this phone off her. Let's try yelling, let's try yelling. Mission failure. Fuck! I don't even know who this bird is! How am I meant to ask my client about any of the stuff? I don't know who they are! There's not enough information given here. Let's think again. Think, you've got us something, uh, 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 phone? The plaintiff seems very fond of her phone. Something interesting there? Or someone interesting? Phones are a treasure trove of personal information. Not to say you don't respect privacy, but if only I had access to her phone. What am I meant to do now? I, maybe I should go to her purse and try stealing it or something. Can I do that? Handbag. That's... I don't think so. What a, a purse? Plaintiff's purse is absolutely bulging. It probably has her personal info. You recall she declined to reveal some of her personal info, which makes it hard for you to see this case in its entirety. You eye her purse curiously. The breaks up. What am I meant to do if you don't even get a chance to ask a follow-up question? How are you meant to do this? I'm going to think about my client. Let's think about client. The client acts strange. Yeah, oh fuck, we've had this one already. I don't know what to do. Asking her isn't going to work. I know, so what do I do? But if you really wanted to, you could distract her with something. What do I distract her with? I don't know, what- a, a cry? I don't fucking know. Ah, oh, fuck this stuck-up bitch and her stupid fucking phone! Remember, you forgot some important Gianna? You think Gianna had beautiful red hair, smart and strange, can't remember, you still have her number every time you look at it. Client said X and Gianna were close, should you call Gianna to investigate? Yes, 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 finally! Your hand feels moist, sweaty. Come on, this is finally something different. Gianna, hello? Gianna, it's me. I need to ask you about- It's been years, don't you now crawling back? Well, guess what? I've moved on, you worthless... Heat... Static, but I heard my client's name. Keeps his phone in my car, haha. <laughs> his girlfriend's great too, but so easy to manipulate. I remember now, this abusive bitch. I'm getting flashbacks. Her abuse was barely noticeable at first. Small insults here and there. I thought I deserved it, but I've grown. I can't let her ways destroy others any longer. Gianna will be next in court. I take the audio recording of the call with the newfound evidence. A restraining order is filed! Oh my god, we did it! 
Not against your client, but against his ex-girlfriend! You promised to keep in touch with your client! Was justice served? Think about the previous domestic situation- Oh my god, we did it! Oh, I'm just an idiot! I finally figured it out! You just had to kind of go through and get the information about Gianna. That's amazing! There's probably loads more endings that I just have no idea about, but... I don't think I have time to try and go through all of them. <laughs> Guys, if you did enjoy watching He Beat Her, this nice little short courtroom game about domestic abuse, be sure to like the video, subscribe to Gamebog if you already haven't, and leave us a comment down there with your feelings on this game and if you guys would like to play it, because there are still quite a lot of different endings, and it's quite interesting that these are very reflective of things that happen in real life. There are a lot of situations that these are paralleling, and so that is very, very fascinating, and it's very cool to try and put people in the pressure of a situation of a lawyer trying to get somebody put away who's been doing all this. It's very, very interesting. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next heavy-themed video. <laughs> Take care, guys. Bye-zies.